many guitar gods depending on, on uh, the time. Um, growing up, um, guys like, all the guys I'd buy their instructional DVDs at the store and learn, like Paul Gilbert and Vinnie Moore and Ingve Malmsteen and Joe Satriani, Steve Vai. As a young player, that's the, what I gravitated towards. Along with the speed metal guys, rhythm stuff, um, like James Hetfield when I was, when I was younger, and um, the guys from Forbidden and um, Exodus, Slayer, Kerry King, and uh, Jeff Hanneman. Their, their riffs were some of my favorite riffs I'd ever heard. Um, some of the chord progressions of Tom G. Warrior were some of my favorite just I was very big on, on the creativity of, of where he went with those simple chord progressions that made such a dark mood. Um, nowadays, um, you kind of grow and you, you find different avenues. Blues and jazz kind of crept in with me and I, I fell in love with Robin Ford's playing, um, Larry Carlton's playing. Um, nowadays, I think Derek Trucks is just about the best guitar player on earth, um, along with a guy like Jeff Beck, whose guitar is sitting right next to us over here. Um, Joe Bonamassa blows my mind how good he is. Um, Warren Haynes. I've, I've kind of gone from the, from the speed metal, thrashy kind of stuff to the more feely, improvised, um, heartfelt stuff that uh, you can only learn if you play since you're a child, and those people have put so many years into it.